one of my friends. I was not going to do a video tip for you today, but here we are. I didn't sleep well last night. I was in such a mood this morning. Like, you know what I mean. And I had to make these apple crumble cookie bars for work. I felt all this resistance. I was like grumpy and all of it. But I took a few deep breaths and I set an intention to soften, soften. And it didn't happen right away. <laughs> but through the process of starting to measure the flour and putter about my kitchen, I just kept holding that focus of softening. And what I found is happening is things have started to shift. Instead of having to do this recipe, it feels like I'm tending to this recipe. And can you like feel that difference between the doing and the tending? There's a reciprocation in tending to something. And even more than that, I've softened towards myself. I'm tending towards myself as I make these cookie bars. And oh my gosh, does that feel so much better than having to knock this off my to-do list. So for this recipe, my invitation for you, if it feels good, is to soften. I know we don't always have the luxury, the privilege of time and quiet, but if you do, maybe give it a try. Soften, tend to the recipe instead of doing the recipe and perhaps tend to yourself as well. We're gonna start by making the dough, which is also the crumble topping. It's made with just oat flour and rolled oats, some sugar and cinnamon, super easy. And then we're going to add softened butter. If you wanna do a vegan version or a dairy-free version, just use a dairy-free butter or even coconut 